Before beginning any epoxy project, please refer to the instructions for use available at IncredibleSolutionsOnline.com. Also be sure to use the epoxy in an optimal working environment. Clean, dry, dust free, between 70 and 85 degrees Fahrenheit. Full instructions available at IncredibleSolutionsOnline.com. Using graduated mixing containers, mix equal parts of base resin and curing agent. Do this on a level surface to ensure a one-to-one -one by volume mix. Using a paint stick, mix the epoxy thoroughly for five minutes. Scrape the bottom and sides of the container to ensure a full mix. After mixing for five minutes, pour the epoxy into a brand new container. Be sure to scrape the bottom and sides so all epoxy is in the new container. This will help ensure a full mix. Mix for an additional three minutes. You may notice that the epoxy turns hazy as the chemicals bond together. Immediately after mixing, pour the epoxy onto your project. If this is the first pour, a very thin seal coat should be used. Pour the epoxy down the center of the project and then use a foam brush or rubber squeegee to move the epoxy to the edges and sides of the project. Coat the entire project. After the project has been fully coated, use a heat source like a torch or a heat gun to remove bubbles. Hold the heat source 6 to 10 inches away from the project using a sweeping motion across the top. You should see the bubbles pop immediately. Allow the project to cure for a minimum of 4 hours before moving on to a flood coat. Repeat the mixing instructions for a flood coat. The epoxy self levels so there is no need to use tools to move the epoxy about the project. Allow it to free flow over the edges, coating the sides and edges of the project. After the flood coat has been applied, use the heat source to remove any bubbles. You should see the bubbles pop immediately. After all air bubbles have been removed, allow the project to cure for a minimum of 24 hours. It should feel hard after 24 hours, however it may take up to 7 days to fully cure depending on temperature. For more information, tips and tricks, refer to IncredibleSolutionsOnline.com.